Hello world, it's your boy Jalen Finn and I have returned with yet another video. And in this video, I thought it would be cool to answer a question from a subscriber. So let's get straight into it. And this question, now the guy's name is Valentino Griffiths. Valentino Griffiths, I appreciate you bro. Thank you for trusting and believing in me man. This is what I love to do, fitness and nutrition. I want to help make the world a better place do those two domains. So let's get straight into the question. Now he said, I have a question, okay? I've been eating broccoli and chicken for a long time, but I found myself kind of slipping of going back for seconds because I don't feel satisfied. And I know you have to have your broccoli hard, not cooked all the way. So I have this question for you. Would you rather eat white rice or brown rice? And you could even make a video on that. So this is basically a two part question, man. Cause he said, He's been slipping, going back for seconds, he don't feel satisfied. So, number one, he's having satiety issues. And number two, he's asking about white rice and brown rice. So let's get into the white rice versus brown rice question first. Let's get into the latter, then we'll tackle the, form, the former. We'll use the latter to answer the former. So the latter, all right? White, rice, ah! I can't even, I, white, ah! Say, say that 10 times fast. White rice, white rice, white rice, white I can't even do it. Anyways, white rice versus brown rice. Very simple difference, guys. Very simple difference. White rice is processed. They remove two parts of the rice. They remove the germ and the bran. The bran contains the fiber. The germ contains the vitamins and minerals. They remove that. They polish the rice and remove that, and then you get white rice. So what does that mean? Brown rice is more healthier because it has the bran, which is the fibrous part. Fiber fills you up, serves as bulk, in the stomach also helps with proper bowel movement but um yeah the bran contains the fiber and also the germ contains the vitamins and minerals which one's better yes the brown rice is going to be better much more nutritious but big butt doesn't taste that good it's not tasty man i gotta be honest with you guys brown rice is not tasty i'm big on health but man we got taste buds we got gustatory receptors for a reason you got to satisfy those taste buds man at least for me, I actually like to enjoy food. That's a part of living, is to enjoy food. Of course, you don't want to compromise your health. You don't want to enjoy food by compromising your health. You want to balance. But there's nutritious food out there that actually tastes good, and brown rice is not one of them. So if you personally don't care about taste, then I'm going to say go with the brown rice. Go with the brown rice without a doubt, unequivocally. Go with the brown rice. But if you care about taste, then I wouldn't recommend it because me personally, I just don't like brown rice, all right? And you gotta remember, man, there's so many different alternatives. There's no one food that you have to eat. Like, if you don't like chicken, then you don't have to eat chicken. If you don't like fish, then you don't have to eat fish. If you don't like broccoli, then you don't have to eat broccoli. I mean, if you don't like chicken, then you can eat beef. <laughs> if you don't like broccoli, then you can eat asparagus. If you don't like grapes, then you can eat strawberries. This many alternatives man there's all types of food all right so i've answered the second question yes the brown rice is much more healthy and nutritious than the white rice but that does not mean that you can't eat white rice but for you i wouldn't recommend you consume white rice because you said you're ready going back for seconds and you're eating broccoli so let's dive right into that first question satiety issues i need to ask you a question are you consuming enough water I always got water on deck wherever I am, man. Just in case I get thirsty, satisfy my appetite. Definitely satisfy my appetite. Water, guess what? There's no calories in here. No calories, guys. But also, guess what? It fills you up. It fills you up. So, if you find yourself slipping and going for seconds, you're probably not consuming enough water. I like to go with about a gallon a day just to be safe. I like to drink more than enough water. Now you can drink too much water, but a gallon should be fine for most healthy men, most healthy teenagers. A gallon of water a day, even females. A female teenager, um, adult female, a gallon of water a day is perfectly fine. And that's really gonna satisfy your appetite. Also, get in more fiber. Get in more fiber. You're eating a few hundred grams of broccoli, get in 500 grams of broccoli. Add more fiber to your diet. You're getting a 25 grams of fiber. Try 35 grams of fiber on top of the water. 
that's going to help diminish your appetite. You must diminish your appetite so that you don't feel hungry and you don't slip up and go for seconds. All right, so that was two tips right there. And I talk about this all the time, diminishing the appetite is very important, but it's very important that I continue to rehash it because I get new subs and I just want people to know this. I want my people, my supporters to actually have this knowledge, to have this knowledge so when it's time for them to get lean or somebody else asks them a similar question in person, they'd be like, oh, I watched that J Living Fit video. Let me disseminate this information to them. Let me pass it on to them. Drink more water, get more fiber. Anyways, the last tip I want to provide you, and I think this might be the most helpful one. This is definitely the most overlooked tip, and many uh, fitness YouTubers don't speak about this one too much. You ready? You ready? You sure you're ready? That is, actually take the time to enjoy your fucking food, man. Don't just take your plate and devour it within like two minutes. No, spend at least eight to 10 minutes enjoying your food. Take multiple chews, chew 20 times. Chew your food 20, 30 times. 20, 30 times. Drink your water in between. Relax, enjoy the food. Eat slowly, savor it. Savor, relish in the moment. Why should you do this? Because you allow for hormones to be secreted. Guys, there's hormones that are responsible for making you feel full. Your body secretes hormones that are responsible for making you feel full, man. Leptin, cholecystic kidney. All right? But it takes time. It takes time for these hormones to be secreted. Because that's one of the reasons why people are obese. That's one of the prevailing reasons why people are obese because they eat their food too fast and they don't get full, so they search for more food. And also it's the refined sugars and saturated fats too because you get those neurotransmitter secretions. And the thing about neurotransmitter secretions in contrast to hormone secretions, the neurotransmitter secretions secrete very quickly, very quickly. They're fast acting, but short lasting. So guess what? You get that dopamine, serotonin, those are neurotransmitters, you get that high, then boom, plummets. And then you're searching for whatever gave you that high again. And then it's a never ending cycle, it's a nasty perpetual cycle. And then that's how people get fat, man. But when you actually take the time to consume healthy, nutritious, fiber rich foods, oh boy, you get so full, man. And you allow time for the longer lasting hormones to be secreted. Cholecystokinin, leptin, man. So try that out. I really hope that helps. I'm really confident and I really truly believe that it's gonna help you out. Those tips, the water, the fiber, and then taking the time to enjoy your food. Spend time enjoying it. So yes, brown rice is more nutritious. Do you have to consume it? No. I highly recommend you get more fiber and more water and enjoy your fucking food, bro. Enjoy your food. And after you enjoy it, then bam, you don't have to think about it no more, okay? You don't have to think about it no more. You're going about your day um, until your body tells you that you're hungry again. That's about it, all right? It's your boy, Jalen Fit. Hope you enjoyed the video. This video is super long. Don't forget to give me a like. Thumbs up, baby. And if you enjoy good quality content, don't forget to subscribe, tell your friends, tell your mom, tell your granny, tell your primo, tell everybody to subscribe to your boy. And also, if you have any fitness and nutrition questions, feel free to leave it in the comment section. And also, feel free to add me on Instagram and DM me or Snapchat. I'm active on that thing, baby. I'm out of here. I'm getting sleepy. I'm going to bed. Peace.